Hey everybody, day 10, Math with Grandma. Here's our Grapes of Math riddle poem. Wind does. Do I say W-I-N-D-O-W-S? I mean windows. This says W-I-N hyphen D-O-Z-E. And when I say doze that way, I mean sleeping. So it's about going to bed at night. I lie in bed and try to sleep, counting windows instead of sheep. How many panes are filled with light? Here is a way that's really bright. Don't just count the lights you see. Subtract the rooms where there is a... Let's see how many rooms are each row. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven plus seven is 14. Plus seven is 21. Plus seven is 28. Plus 7 is 35. Minus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 35 minus 7 is 28. Windows. Money in the United States. Because that's where we live. Grandma also gives you money to put in your piggy banks. I give you little brown copper pennies and big silver nickels and tiny silver dimes and big old quarters. Sometimes there are half dollars, but not very often. And then there are some dollar coins. There's the really big Eisenhower coin and the Sacagawea one and the Susan B. Anthony and a couple of others. You'll have to go look in your piggy bank to see what's in there. When did the United States begin using dollars? In 1792. Our country began as a country in 1776, so just a few years later. And Alexander Hamilton was the first treasurer of the United States. That's why his picture's on the $10 bill. The United States adopted the dollar as its unit of money. Where was the first U.S. Mint? The first United States Mint was established in Philadelphia in 1792. What were the first coins? In 1794, silver coins were minted. In 1795, gold coins were minted. First cents and half cents were minted in, in 1793. And here's what they looked like. Not a lot different than what we have today. Fun fact. A dime gets its name from dimes, a system based on 10, or dismays, a system based on 10. The Latin word for 10 is dismiss. A quarter gets its name because it's a quarter or one-fourth of a dollar. A dollar gets its name from the German word taller, which is shortened from the word, uh, I can't read that in German. J. O A C H I M S T H I L E R. Joachim Schmeller. Joachim Schmeller. It's a coin made in the town of Joachim Schmall in Czechoslovakia. Grandma can't pronounce things like that. Here we go. Okay, we talked about speed yesterday and how a car travels in miles per hour. A cheetah is the fastest mammal. A cheetah runs in bursts up to 70 miles an hour, but it has to stop and catch its breath after a short sprint. A cheetah runs like a cat, but it has teeth and claws like a dog. A sports car can get more than 200 miles per hour. That's faster than a cheetah. The car doesn't have to stop to catch its breath, but it could run out of gas. Since it's day 10 of math, I thought it would be a good day to read 10 Apples Up on Top by Dr. Seuss. Look at all the apples. Who likes apples? 10 apples up on top. One apple up on top. I think he's supposed to be a lion. 
two apples up on top. One, two. Up. Oh. There's a dog coming up. <gasps> Look, you, I can do it too. Look, see, I can do three. There, 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 I see, I see. If you can do three, now I can do more. You have three, but I have four. Whoa. He's jumping rope at the same time. Look, see, now I can hop with four apples up on top. You girls still have your jump ropes? That'd be something to try. Oh, my. I don't think that looks very safe. And I can hop up on a tree with four apples up on me. Oh. There's a tiger. One, two, three, four, five. I don't think balancing apples on top of your head is that easy. I wonder if we could try it. I don't have any apples on my, in my, the house. I have a candle. And it doesn't want to stay up on my head very well. It just wants to slide off. I can't imagine what a round bottom apple would want to do. Look here, you two. See here, you two. I can get five on top. Can you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm so good I will not stop. Five, now six, now seven on top. Seven apples up on top. I am so good they will not drop. Five, six, seven, fun, fun, fun. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. But see, we are as good as you. Look, now we have seven, two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. Seven plus seven is 14, plus seven is 21. Hey, we just counted by sevens in our window book, too. Stop it. Oh. And now, see here, eight, eight on top. Eight apples on top. Not one will drop. He's roller skating. Eight, eight, eight. Now we can skate. Look, now we can skate with eight. But see, I can do nine and hop and drink. You cannot do this, I think. Hey, drink, think. That all rhymes together. We can, we can, we can do it too. See here, we are as good as you. We are all very good, I think. With nine, we think can we can hop and drink. Uh-oh. We have one more apple. Nine plus one is going to be ten. Nine is very good, but then come on, and we will make it ten. <coughs> she doesn't look very happy. Look out, look out. I see a mop. I will make the apples fall. Get out, get out, you one and all. Come on, come on, come down this hill. We must not let our apples fall. Oh, come down the hall. 
this hall and fall one time. Out of our way, we cannot stop. We will not let our apples drop. Uh-oh. Delegating being attacked by the air. This is not good. What will we do? They want to get our apples, too. They will get them if we let them. Come, we will, cannot let them get them. Look out, the mop, the mop, the mop. We cannot stop our apple fun. Our apples will not drop, not one. What an apple chase. They must not get our apples down. Come on, come on, get out of town. Apples, apples up on top. All of this must stop, stop, stop! See how the words are getting bigger there? So Grandma wants stop, stop, stop! Uh-oh. Look what they're finding. These are going to run down. All our fun is going to stop. All our apples are going to drop. Look, ten apples on us all. What fun. We will not let them fall. Let's see. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120. Ten apples up on top. Okay, here's our math equals fun book, Count by Ten by Jerry Pilato, illustrated by Rob Bolster. Oh, hey. Yeah same author and illustrator combination. Rob Bolster did the illustrations for this book and this book. How about that? Count by tens. And Grandma has her counting by tens tray ready. One. We are on our way to 100. How can we get there? We're going to count by tens, but first let's count from one to ten, one piece of fruit at a time. We are now on number one, the holly helicopter. Hey, it's a helicopter. A helicopter carries one strawberry. Ooh, the speedboat has one, two pineapples. The airplane has one, two, three limes. Pony cart has one, two, three, four red apples. <gasps> the hot air balloon has one, two, three, four, five bananas. Grandma messed up her tray. Uh oh, where'd that other one go? Oops. The school bus, wheels on the bus go round and round, has one, two, three, four, five, six oranges. Oh, peaches. <gasps> A blimp has seven slices of watermelon. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh. <gasps> The train, choo-choo, has eight raspberries. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <gasps> the bicycle has nine blueberries. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
Ooh, what's coming next? Ten. The race car has ten cherries. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Put the sports car in reverse. Do a review. Count again. This time use Mount Rainier cherries. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, we can count backwards. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one, zero. Now we're going to count to 100 by tens. We're counting by tens. Next ten number is not 11. This old Model T will take us to 20. So we're skip counting now. We skip counted with even numbers, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and odd numbers, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11. Now we're going to skip count by tens. And we already know our number song. We can count by tens up to 100. We can count by tens. Ready, here we go. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. We're going to skip count with the book. One group of 10, two groups of 10, 10, 20. 20 orange slices. A golf cart's another way to get around, but this is no time for sports. We're learning to count by tens. We have 10 cantaloupe halves, or cantaloupe halves this time, so let's count them. 10, 20, 30. Oh, look at the old biplane. It's gonna take us to 40. Concord grapes. 10, 20, 30, 40. Oh, look at the big cruise ship. It's going to take us to 50 lemons. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 50. Sounds funny when we stop in the middle of the song, doesn't it? Ooh. This taxi cab is going to give us 60 kiwis. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Ooh, look at the big monster truck. It's going to take us to 70 honeydew melons. 10, 20, 30. 40, 50, 60, 70. Come on, Paige. Grandma's fingers are not being very nimble this morning. There we go. It's going to take us... Oh, look at the space shuttle. It's going to rocket us to 80. 10, 20, 30... 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. Whoa, it's a dog sled, like in Balto. That dog sled's going to get us to 90. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Whoa, look at that really quick dragster. Huh. We're going to get to 100 really fast. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. We did it. Oh, there's a unicycle. Oh, no. You know, uni. One. We can count backwards. 190, 80, 70, 60, 50, 40, 30, 20, 10, 0, 1. Counting by tens.